Hey guys, I just wanted to show you a, uh, I wanted to put on here a tutorial I did on TikTok. Um, if you want to go follow me on TikTok so you can see more of my tutorials, it's at Glitterscapes Co. So this is a beautiful vinyl from uh, Bright Swan that I got in one of their boxes. It's absolutely gorgeous. And so what I'm doing is I just cut two five inch squares and I'm putting one on either side. And it's actually super simple to do this. It's not, it's not hard. So you do want to make sure that your, your edges are lined up because um, we are going to cut a little bit of that away. And you've seen, I, I did another tutorial just like this that you guys saw. And so I'm basically doing the same thing. I'm just cutting out the um, excess right there. Because I don't, the reason I cut this out is I don't want that crease to show through the epoxy. I don't know if it would or not, but I like the way it looks anyway, cutting this out. So, it's wanting to be fussy with me and not peel up, so. But that's really what I did. So, it just leaves one of the corners there. So, when it leaves, when you put this on there, it leaves kind of a pretty big to me anyway it leaves a pretty big divot so that's why I cut it off so and be careful peeling that up because I actually scratched my vinyl right there but you can't see in the final product so unless you're looking for it of course so this was the second video I did on TikTok same cup I actually went in and painted that cup with um, blush by pop of color paint and I'm adding on uh, glitter from PDB. It's called It's It's Just Frank. It's All Frank. Something like that. It's a, it's a Lisa Frank inspired glitter. So we just, I added that on. Um, I did use the epoxy method to add this on because it's easier for me. So basically when you do the epoxy method, um, what I did was I taped off my vinyl and mixed up five milliliters of epoxy which i did not need that much but that's the least amount i can do and then as soon as your glitter is on you want to peel this tape and i actually taped the the vinyl before i painted the cup so it was tape the vinyl paint the cup put the epoxy on apply the glitter in that order but you do want and the the tapes being huffy with me but um, you do want to peel this tape off as soon as you get your glitter on. You do not want that epoxy to dry with that tape on there because it will, it will not come off. It'll be a pain in the butt. Well, it'll come off, but it'll be a pain in the hiney to get it off. So you just want to get off as get it off as quick as you can after you get that glitter put on. So we're almost done here taking this off, and you'll see the. Um, the raw glitter moment. So after two coats of epoxy, because this is kind of a little bit of a chunky glitter, I went in with some vinyl stripes and I just cut the vinyl stripes out of, I cut the vinyl stripes out with my Cricut. Um, I'm using Tech Wrap Craft vinyl. It's just kind of a a color shift this is a color shift orange pink purple vinyl and I thought it would be really pretty on here so I'm just going through and vinyling or putting that vinyl stripe vine I don't even know if that's a word y'all putting that vinyl <laughs> striping all around the cup and I basically just followed the lines on this one um, super simple I didn't go fancy or anything like that I just followed the the outline of the the vinyl cut that we did so it was super easy and I think I told y'all this vinyl is from Bright Swan um, there is a link down below for Bright Swan to save you some money y'all she has got some gorgeous vinyl um, she just came out with some 3d uh, vinyl 
I know, I don't know if you guys have seen the uptick in 3D sublimation tumblers. Um, I've actually done some of those. Those are on my TikTok as well. But she's got the 3D vinyl. And y'all, when you put epoxy over 3D vinyl, it looks amazing. It looks like it's actually sticking out. And, you know, it's not. It's flat. It's just like, you know, regular vinyl. But it's got so much dimension and it's so pretty. So after I got the, the pink put on, I just went in with some silver. This is a, hol a holographic silver um, tech wrap vinyl as well. So I just went in and I did not show you all this because this is how I did it on TikTok. Because you know TikTok videos have to be short. So I just went in over that pink with just some little thin lines. And I, if, if I could remember how I cut the dimensions... I cut this striping, I would tell you, but I kind of just go by sight. I don't really pay attention to, <clears throat> excuse me, the size or anything like that that I cut it. I probably should start writing that down for people, but I don't know if anybody really pays attention to what length and width they cut their vinyl striping, so... I just go by whatever whatever looks good. There's also a code down below for Tech Wrap. They have um, gorgeous vinyl as well. And if you're wanting any of the, like the chameleon vinyl or you know the color shift or the glow in the dark or they have a million different options and they're really not expensive at all. So I have a code down below there too. So that's before the last coat of epoxy. And here's after the final coat of epoxy. This is the final result, guys. She turned out absolutely beautiful. And she will be on my website. 